So what I've done first is I've done a basic drawing of the aviary. Um, it's going to be six foot high, five foot long, three foot wide. By doing the drawing, it's a lot easier to calculate how much timber I need. Here I have all the timber already cut to length. This timber came in 15 foot lengths. I have it all cut now. What I'm going to do first is I'm going to paint this first before I start putting the sections together. I have all the timber painted now so it's time to put it all together. I've all the sections put together now. This is going to be uh, the front of the Avery. Next step is to start putting on our wire. That's all the sections wired now. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hang the door. I also have this smaller door above it to hang as well. It's much easier to do this when it's on the ground than if it was uh, standing up. That's the every finished now. Once I had the two doors hung, I just screwed all the sections together. The other bits and pieces I've done is I've put in these perches and also instead of having to open this main door every time I want to feed and water the birds just made this small section here and put a shelf in it so I can put the seed ball and the water ball so it makes it a lot easier when feeding and watering the birds and also less chance that the birds can fly out on you other thing that I've done is this Avery I have it wired on the inside the reason for this is because if you keep parakeets or parrots it prevents the birds from picking or chewing the timbers it's just one step left to do that is to put some birds in it 